Most guys focus on training and protein, yet they fail to neglect the most important thing or one of the most important things for their testosterone levels. And if you don't take care of this, you're literally not giving your body a chance to produce testosterone. And it's about micronutrients, and I'm gonna show you a hack that I use every single day to make sure that my testosterone is as high as possible. And I've taken this straight out of the High Testosterone Blueprint, which is my program, which you can find in the description. First of all, we need to understand what micronutrients we actually need for our body to produce testosterone. Starting off with just an essential one is your fat, so your saturated monounsaturated fats, cholesterol. Cholesterol is made out of fats. If you don't give your body any fats, you're not gonna make enough cholesterol. If you don't have enough cholesterol, your body is not going to produce testosterone because testosterone is synthesized and your hormones are synthesized via cholesterol. You've got your B vitamins, this is obviously B1 all the way through to like B12. You've got selenium, which is used to protect your Leydig cells, which is where you produce testosterone. And you've got magnesium, boron, D3, and you've got omega-3s as well. What I do every single day, the hack that I use is I microdose certain foods every single day to make sure that I'm hitting as many, if not all of these, all of the time. So I'm just fully saturated in terms of micronutrients for my body to produce testosterone. The first one that I do is such an easy one to do, is Brazil nuts. And you literally do one to two Brazil nuts a day. They're tiny, yet they cover all of your selenium if you just have one or two a day. If you're having loads of eggs and loads of red meat, six, seven, eight plus eggs a day, you might not need to do this, but you can just still have them in your house. And if you don't get enough eggs or red meat in the day, you just have one or two Brazil nuts. Easy, covers your selenium. Selenium, essential again for protecting your Leydig cells, protecting the cells that produce your testosterone. Number two is one that not a lot of people like, but I microdose liver every single day. Chicken liver specifically at the moment, obviously beef liver is the best, but you just do 30 to 50 grams a day. I do more like 30, but you're covering all B vitamins, you're covering, oh, that's one I forgot, you're covering zinc, you're covering iron, you're covering cholesterol and protein, and, and it's a superfood. If you just have a little bit every single day, all I do is I cook my eggs, take the eggs out the pan, chuck a little bit of liver in for one or two minutes, and then it's done, and it's just that simple, and I just treat you like a supplement, and I can buy in the UK like 150 grams for, one pound fifty three dollars and it's superfood i treat these all like supplements and it's the way to do it and like i said if you want the full system to naturally optimize your testosterone do check out the high testosterone blueprint in the description because it's every single possible component about natural testosterone optimization all inside one program so go check it out after this video number three is eggs this is a pretty obvious one to some guys maybe it's not but doing eggs it's, it's a multivitamin again, it's sort of like liver. You're getting every single essential vitamin that your body needs except vitamin C. And you can just do six plus eggs a day. It's gonna take care of your health massively. It's gonna cover so many essential micronutrients that you need. I have eggs every single day, it's at least four, but preferably you wanna be doing six plus eight, 10, 50. If you said you wanna do 15 eggs a day, Go and do 15 eggs a day. The cholesterol is not going to be a problem, especially if you're a healthy, lean individual that's not, you know, got 40% body fat. Eat your eggs, essential. And the next one is extra virgin olive oil. This is a very easy one again, because obviously you just buy the bottle and I just put like a teaspoon or a tablespoon on every single meal that I eat because you're getting monounsaturated fats, you're getting polyphenols, you're getting antioxidants. It is a complete superfood. The micronutrients you're going to find in extra virgin olive oil. Obviously try and get the best quality olive oil you can and try and use it after cooking instead of using it to cook with. This is when you get the most quality out of the oil. But I just do a teaspoon of every single meal and it's again it's a very very easy way to just hack these nutrients into your diet. And now supplements because a few of these are missing. I would recommend everyone's supplements boron. You can do five to ten milligrams. This is to reduce SHBG and increase your free testosterone. Number two is I'd recommend you supplement magnesium glycinate. You do 400 milligrams. Unless you eat a lot of fish, I would supplement an omega-3 supplement and have anywhere from one to two grams a day. And only supplement zinc if you don't get enough red meat, eggs, and or liver inside of your diet. But if you do this, you start microdosing these foods every single day, you are going to notice a major difference in your testosterone. This is how you should focus your diet if your goal is high testosterone. You should pick out and realize every single micronutrient that you need 
for testosterone and build a diet around that. And that's exactly what I've done in the blueprint is I've just built the perfect diet for testosterone that covers every single micronutrient every single day. And it's a pretty simple diet to be fair. If you want the full system, like I say, the high testosterone blueprint is a complete step-by-step -step program to naturally optimize your testosterone. So you can get into the 750, 800 range where you experience all of the benefits that testosterone gives, that strong libido, you find it easy to build muscle, find it easy to lose fat, you're confident, you've got drive, you've got a high value physique, if you want all of those things, go and check it out. But apart from that, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found some value from it. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.